ETM Sai International with DJ Tringo. Throwback Mondays. Check, check, check. This is DJ Lexi. <laughs> hey, guys. I know I stole DJ Tringo's um, introduction, but guys, I'm about to have an interview. I'm hoping you guys are looking forward to it. It, it, it is with um, recording artist Don G. So this is his song, guys. I hope you guys are vibing to it, just like me. Check, check. Hello. 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 Greetings, we have Don greetings. G. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, I'm on. Okay. Glad to have you on here, Mr. Don G. <laughs> yes, definitely. Gosh. Okay, guys. Um, I don't know if anybody is um unfamiliar with him, but this is Rashid Steele. Did I say that correctly? 
Rashid. Yes, yes. Okay, Rashid Steele. That's, that's so it is. Okay, aka Don G, the man with so much experience under his belt, guys. This guy's he has been on Sting, Black River, Irie FM, man, Irie FM in the area role, you know, Sizzla, charity concert. You, you, man, you have a lot of experience. I said that before, man. <laughs> yeah, man, we'll leave, we'll leave a lot. Hey, all right sorry about that so um okay let's start off because uh since you have a lot of experience in your belt you you've been around for a while now so how long have you been an artist well i've been an artist since birth you know what i mean i was born singing doing music oh my God, but take it good. seriously like at age maybe age 14 15 I take it more seriously to start to go studio and such, but I was singing from a early age as a toddler, you know. Oh wow! You see, like, it sound yeah. like as you came out of your mom, you were singing. Exactly. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because the first song I sing is when when I when I started to cry. You know what I mean? When I born from my mom womb, when I started to cry. That's the first melody. <laughs> <laughs> You have to start from somewhere. You're right. You're right. Oh, exactly. Yeah. So you know, we just said that. Said it's, it's it's an in, it's an inborn thing. You know what I mean? It's an inborn natural thing. You know what I mean? Definitely. Yeah. yeah you um like artists. You know, just like a mathematician, mathematician or whatever. You're you're supposed to have some type of birthright. You know, you have to. It has to be natural. It comes from within. Exactly. You know? Exactly. So, so you said you started from your 14. That was when you were in um, high school. So that no, was... No, actually, I was going to high school at 40. Yes, yes, yes. That was in high school. Exactly, yes. That was high school, yeah. yeah. Okay. And you are... Uh, you attended Bogwalk High School. So... Yes. So how was it, you know, be being an artist? Like, you know, your classmates are like, oh, yeah, this guy is my artist in my class. Well, as as far as I could remember, going to high school, like, I was I was acknowledged as a celebrity. Because okay. that's where my name even arrived from, as genius. Before I was called genius, you know what I mean? Oh, based on academics, me. based on academics, because while I was in class, like, teacher may ask a question or such, and I'm the first one to always discover and come up with the answers. You know wow. what I mean? So my classmate called a genius. Then eventually, you know what I mean, going along the way, my friends, I, I, I meet up with a producer in Kingston. Mm -hmm. He say, yo, you, you sang them body, the vibes and the melody and the words, them, you know what I mean? Damn genius of him. So Don G oh. start use that genius, you know. Oh. I mean, then after that, you know, meet up with other people along the way, you know, who the road me and manage my music. They must say the genius too long then. So just call yourself that G. So from here and then that's how I start to work with the name Dan G. So it's a long way from high school till you know what I mean, till now. Okay, so it sounded. Did you did you um have like another name that you go, you went by before Don G or it just it just came naturally after? Yeah, that? as a, as a, as a, as I told you before, genius. That that was my name before. Genius. Oh, genius was your name before, you know I mean? and then so, you changed right, to Don G. So right, the G in Don G it stands for genius. But as I say, um, my my fellow friends and such say it's too long. So they call me Donji. So from there and then I start to work with Donji. But okay. who know me from long time? Sometimes they still call me genius. You know. <laughs> what I mean? Okay. Yeah. I mean that's really good. That's really good. Uh, yeah. So yeah. that means, you know, everything came naturally. So you know, exactly. you just knew that this was the profession you had to go into. It's not. It's not. It wasn't like a sudden thing. Exactly. Naturally was naturally okay good good so like where does your main inspiration come from when you're writing when you're um writing your songs well my main inspiration mainly comes from the most i and 
natural stuff that's happening around me. My inspiration basically derives from life, life happenings and day-to-day happenings. You know, that's how I, I gain inspiration to compose my music. So I sing what's going on, yes. what is visual to me, oh, real okay. stuff, right? Wow. So that's that's how my inspiration comes. So it's like everyday influence around you, you get to, you just put it down on paper you write it down for your songs. I got you. Right, 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 right. Not exactly literally paper. That was before I used to write my songs on paper. But now I memorize songs. You know oh. what I mean? So if I came up, if I if I come up with something, I memorize it. Yes. Yeah, so it's there in my brain. So when I go to the studio, I record. Or sometimes I'm this artist. Like if I hear a beat, an instrumental, no matter what it is, from mm-hmm. it sound good and it construct properly. I'm this type of artist. I can have a conversation. I can communicate with a beat. So the beat talk to me, and oh, I answer wow. the beat with a song. Wow. And normally that song that I put on the beat, it will be a hit song like if you listen to my music all my songs they are hit songs oh wow okay you're you're right you i like your um your songs i've listened to them and they're very catchy like i especially love the what was the song i think it was bubble for me baby <laughs> i like that one <laughs> uh, okay that new one that, yeah, that's a new one There's well that song one. i'm okay. just i'm just yeah i'm just i'm just testing the market with that song you know okay. that's a dancehall song but mainly i do reggae music but okay. then i don't want to be this artist who is labeled as just, just a reggae artist and in one box i don't want to trap myself I will never do that. So I have to show my versatility. And being a Jamaican, you know, reggae and dance uh, is our culture. So I have to embrace my culture. Okay, that you know? you're right. You're right about yeah. that. So um, like you said, being Jamaican, and I know you're in the UK. How was it when you, you know, you left from Jamaica as an artist and then well, you up there? Yeah, well, I'm not currently in the UK right now. Okay. I'm in Europe. Oh, you're in I'm Europe. I'm in Europe my bad. right now. Right. So how was it like being in Europe compared to like um, have being an artist in Jamaica, like promoting? Well, and- uh, yeah, being in Europe, it's more different. And then I, I gain a lot of experience because in Europe, you know, in Europe, they celebrate the culture the reggae music they have the reggae festivals oh you know i did I mean? not so in jamaica they don't have festivals they oh, label wow. the labels labels these events as um stage show but here they celebrate the culture and they call it festival so it's a different here on the scene of reggae music you know what i mean that's true yeah. i've heard like um it is a lot more popular in other countries i'm not really saying popular but um, the culture it is, it is, it is, it is, it is, it is. Reggae music is popular in Europe, and I've Bob Marley that. is still one of the biggest reggae artists out of Jamaica. Oh yeah, yeah. I know. I mean, like, there's an experience I can say that you know. What I mean, that's true. Because yeah. even me being in the U- U.S., people still ask. Because sometimes like, you know, what I mean, being here. Yeah. Showing me a lot and letting me know the artists that really break and really cross boundaries because there's a lot of artists I don't want to um bash on one yeah but it's just the truth there's a lot of artists in Jamaica we consider as um big artists and big names but outside of the country they are not because when you travel and you hear the radios or you hear music playing or you go to the festival you don't hear them or you don't see them many people still speaking about bob marley yeah you that's know true I mean? that's true. right and most most artists i hear on the radio is like sean paul jimmy cliff shaggy shaba and yeah, it's Marley. people like have history. Yeah. Like I mean, like you, you right. have a history. So you there and then you it. see the artists that really break to the mainstream out of Jamaica. So being here and being among these playlists, it make me feel overwhelmed and and so proud of myself. You know, okay. being shot in the journey. Yeah. Okay, that's good. I mean, like, so that means you have a specific artist that you look up to, or is there anybody that? 
like you want to emulate well yes know? yes because there's a lot of artists that 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 paved the way for us as musician now so trying to be a i look up to money. there are many artists i look up to in this music industry okay you know? that's good that's good so um yeah. for like for our viewers that for graffiti like fan base who is that don g like could you give me a description of who you are and what give me something that you know we don't know about you you know for our listeners well don g is just a normal being a normal person you know what i mean don g is this humble youth you know what i mean you sure that's and not Rashid Steele, huh? I'm not Danji, because you, you know, you have so much experience. You know, Danji is the celebrity, Rashid is the normal person, you know. Well, <laughs> I, would, I, would left, I would left the fans and you as the disc jack who is <laughs> listening and who is um, focusing on my work, you know what I mean, to say that. I, I don't want to be self-proclaimed and call myself this and call myself that, because my music is much more bigger than me you know what i mean so yeah. i will never like exaggerate and and do stuff like that but i'm thankful i give the most i thanks for what's going on for me now and i ask him to just continue to guide me back the way to sing good music and come up with good inspiration okay, so i could okay. fill the people's soul with good music worse in this terrible time that we live in you're here. Right. I can I, I can see that you're very humble. I can tell that. I mean, the humility I am, that you I am, have to. I am. Have. I can't. I can't. I, I can't get excited. So, this is something that you ask something to say to the people that they don't know about me. I can't. I can't get excited for nothing. Oh, you, know? <laughs> you said you can't get excited uh, for nothing. Yeah. I mean, don't worry. There's a there. You like have things a lot good, more. <laughs> good things will happen. Things good will happen, and I feel it, and I feel thankful, and I feel good inside. But I don't express it and and show it. You know what I mean? I'm just humble. Okay, know? so you you basically you're reserved. You keep a lot of things into yourself. Like if you celebrate, exactly. you're celebrating it within. You don't. You're not like um, boastful. <laughs> You know, because in the Bible, you know, there, you know, you can't be too boastful. But then, you know, that's another story. Most definitely. Most definitely. Standard behavior it is, you know. <laughs> yes, sir. So, um, yeah. I know you said that it's, this is, being an artist is like something from birth, right? You, it's a birthright. However, yeah. in like some alternate universe, if you weren't an artist, is there something else that you uh, wanted to be like when you were gr growing up as a kid? You wrote in your, you know, they always ha have like, they always ask you what, you know, what do you want to be when you grow up? Like, is there something that you wanted to be before well, as an artist? Other than music, other than music, I'm a sports person. I used to play football. Okay. Yes, yeah, soccer. All right. So even from that time, I was. I was mentioned and called a celebrity because I was this star baller going to primary school and scoring goals for the primary school and also an exhibition player. So maybe okay, if okay. I didn't do music, I would be like playing football. Okay. You know, so I you, used to so play in the first and catching. I got bought from from um, officials to play force and catching while I was going to um, primary school. Oh wow! Yeah. Okay, that, but other that than sports, also <laughs> other than ball. sports, also I'm also mm -hmm. a businessman. I used to do um business clerical back in high school. So maybe if I would do if I wasn't doing music now, mm -hmm. I would be doing like some business. You know what I mean? But knowing the business stuff, I merge them with my music mm -hmm. and. I conduct my music as a business, even though I have a manager also, you know. Okay. So maybe I would be even sitting in an office because I, 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 I have um, um, recommendations in um, administration. And even being here in Europe, uh, I do a little study in administration and, and I'm certified in administration also. So I could be sitting in an office, but 
music is what I love, it's my passion, so this is what I'm doing from my heart to the people. Yeah. Okay, awesome. So, okay, we're so like, what are some songs that you want the listeners to be introduced to? Like, are there anything that you want us to, you know, want us to play for your listeners today? Well, definitely, I got, I got, I got two new songs out, or three new songs out. You know, mm-hmm. firstly, you play Arts Desire. That's my new single out, also from Wizard House Production. Mm-hmm. That's the producer from Dominica. Yeah, and I got um, Bubble for Me Baby one more time, which is also a new dancehall track from One Tree Record, which is also my manager. Okay. Yeah, and Ja Never Leave. Ja Never Leave is a big project under Redemption Rhythm, courtesy of No Rush. You know what I mean? So I'm on that project. It's called Ja Never Leave. So you could play that one for the people also. Okay, okay. All you know right. I mean? So um, we're going to go on a short break so you guys can hear yeah. his new single. We have Bubble for My Baby next. So <laughs> we're going to... We're gonna play that for y'all. So give me one sec. So you not get the right loving what you want. So she won't let farm on because I'm not too smart. Me no know this girl reach for my chat. No put a bag on for it and say fill a gun for it. She grab on for it. Drag on for it. She grab on for it. I start get panic. She want me to sink it like Titanic. Bubble for me, baby. One more time. Why not turn from the dan punchline? Bubble for me, baby. One more time. If loving is a crime, I would have do the time. Bubble for me, baby. One more time. Why not turn from the dan punchline? Bubble for me, baby. One more time. If loving is a crime, I would have do the time. Girl, come over. Me, she can't get over. My girl, tell her boyfriend it on the relationship it over. What kind of drama am I bring you come? Not take no box, not no kick down. Have no knowledge and wisdom. Not giving the chance to bring it down. Bubble for me, baby, one more time. Why not turn from the dance punchline? Bubble for me, baby, one more time. And if loving is a crime, I would have done the time. Bubble for me, baby, one more time. Why not turn from the dance punchline? Bubble for me, baby, one more time. If loving is a crime, I would have done it. Now nah, Yo, I jabbling. We could have be there, bubble. I don't do again. She won't forget me, not trouble. Yo, fire. Call her and tell her standard behavior. Bubble for me, baby, one more time. Why not turn from the dan punchline? Bubble for me, baby, one more time. If loving is a crime, I would have do the time. Bubble for me, baby, one more time. Why not turn from the dan punchline? Bubble for me, baby, one more time. If loving is a crime, I would have do the time. Now get it all you want, so you take it to heart. So you not get the right loving what you want So she run left for man because he's not too smart Me no know this girl reach for my chat Me put a bag on for it and say fill a gun for it She grab on for it, drag on for it She grab on for it and start get panic She want me to sink it like Titanic Bubble for me baby, one more time Why not turn from the dan punchline Bubble for me baby, one more time If loving is a crime I would have do the time Bubble for me baby, one more time Why not turn on the dance punchline, chilling, chilling, Saturday. One more time, if loving is a crime, I would have done the harm if it's your body's on the money's true. Them, don't know, keep it locked to be the electricity. Firm and strong when she feels the realist. Garments take off, I love Victoria's secret. All is mine, she want me keep it for a lifetime. Pull doors off, severe the landmine. Treasure, your body's on the money's true. Them, bubble for me, baby. One more time. Why not turn from the dan punchline? Bubble for me, baby, one more time. If loving is a crime, I would have do the time. Bubble for me, baby, one more time. Why not turn from the dan punchline? Bubble for me, baby, one more time. If loving is a crime, I would have do the time. Now nah, get it all you want, so you take it to heart. So you not nah, get the right loving what you want. So she won't let for man because him not too smart. Me no know this girl reach for my chat. No put a bag on for it and say fill a gun for it. She grab on for it. Drag on for it, she grab on for it, and start get panic. She want me to sink it like Titanic. Bubble for me, baby, one more time. Why not turn on the dance punchline? Bubble for me, baby, one more time. If we is is a crime, I will not do the time. Bubble for me, baby, one more time. Be a 
Alexis on the modest children. Okay, guys, we're back with Don G for his <laughs> exclusive interview with Graffiti M. Sai Live Radio. Okay, that Don G. So I just introduced some some of your songs to the guys. I know they're still vibing, but we still have to ask our questions. <laughs> so yes, yes, DJ Lexi, Arts <laughs> Desire. One more time, but but yes. yeah, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Those yeah, are my new single out good. now, you know what I mean? So, the listeners, you can stream these songs, all right? Give thanks. Okay, awesome. I mean, we're going to... I'm going to ask you, ask you to tell us your social media handle and everything at the end. But we're going to leave that best for last, okay? All right. Okay, cool. <laughs> okay. All right, so like out of all of your songs, I know these two are the newest, but out of all of your songs, are there any songs that you like the most that, you know, that was the best song for you and why? Well, to tell her the song, to tell her the truth, all my songs are my favorite. I like all my songs. So I'll be know? like, well, which but, one is the most? Yeah, put my the most favorite, in? my mm-hmm. favorite song is that we need a change we need a change you know no, yeah, yeah. It, this this song is deep you know what i mean i touch on a troubling topic that was affecting the world long before this pandemic that's going on no yeah. that song was released like 2018 and you know like i was wow. seeing things beyond you know i was seeing a far away so we need a change you know, fans can listen that song. For who don't know that song, you can get to know that song. Yeah, that's that's my favorite, Don G. You really need right a change. Now. I can. Yeah, I feel like it. You need a change. Has to do more with, you know, more emotions and you know, all to do with the Jamaican environment. I'm assuming. I know it had to do with because there was a lot of stuff happening back back in the day, and even now, it is so. It, 
it's still it seems like it's not getting better right now. So you know, for exactly. to have a song that people can, you know, think about, you know, to relate to. Exactly. Right, exactly. Current affairs, you know what I mean? Yes. Yeah. All right. So like where do you see yourself in five years from now? Where do you see Don G from right now? Like, where do you plan to be in the future? Well, I see myself five years from now being a better person that I am today. Being more mature, you know, being myself and also being mature, doing music. And I've started this thing. I'm producing artists also. So oh, five wow. years from now, I will be also putting some artists on the forefront, sending them to the world. As now, I am working on a project that's called The Redemption Rhythm that's produced by me, Donji Music, and No Snitch Music, which is my label. So mm -hmm. fans can listen that from me. That's my third production many people don't know this about me that i produce also i'm not only singing okay wow but this is also an inspiration from Mustai to help other artists who hadn't got the experience to be air played to be on tour and you know what i mean all what music acquire this is my little helping and Okay, that, that, that's good. that means you that who exactly is on this Friends. if I'm able to ask who exactly is on this um Re redemption al album with you okay this right. redemption album is produced by no rush records you have a uh, queen I freak on that project mm. you have um Tony Curtis you have um loot and fire you have this suit called got you you have DYCR, you have Busy Signal, you have okay. Okay. Natural wow. Blocks, wow. you know what I mean? A host of artists, top artists. And this project mm -hmm. is also distributed by the Marlies, which is the Tough Gang International. So oh, okay. it's a sad project, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Okay, so here's Jan an interesting Lee. question, though. Do you see yourself ever being in a clash, like on stage, you know, with another artist? No. You said no. no that I was a quick no. No, though. I don't. I don't got. I, I don't got. I so don't. You got wouldn't the take the offer up for a clash. I mean? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't need that attention. You know what I mean? He said, "No, yeah. you're you're too. You're reg. You're a reggae. You have to do. You're a lover. You don't. You're yeah, not a fighter. and it's not. I'm not this artist. You will never from from." Coming up in music till now, you'll never hear Danji name in no you said form. Never, of ever, mix up. ever. No mix up, <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay. Nothing on social media. Nothing You're right. On, I haven't seen anything. You know what I mean? Nothing that, that that negative just at push all. Positive energy, you know what I mean? Okay. You know that's, I mean, that's good. I just know, you know, you know, from a standpoint of fans, people like seeing, you know, it you not really negativity, but you know it, it is it garners attention when you do stuff like that. But I can understand you have to keep your integrity as your as an artist. Exactly, exactly. You know you have to have a standard. You know what I mean? And standard behavior it is. That that's true. So uh, like how in regarding that, how would you handle like negative like social media comments and remarks about you as an artist? Well, I have songs? to. Yeah, to tell you the truth, I have never experienced. Seriously, I've never, I have never seen no one left a bad comment or no post. Never ever. Since I have, never since I have social media. I've been on okay. social media since um, maybe two thousand and eight, mm -hmm. maybe something like that. Yeah, two thousand and eight. I've been on social media so from that time until now. I have. Never seen a bad comment. <laughs> so you mean like never. you've never even had like a thought to say, okay, this is how I'm going to handle this if um, somebody no, attacks me. No. On, they said no, never. So not having, so not having that experience, uh, there's, there's nothing to handle, 
in no negative way, you know what I mean? Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's well, just basically I mean, it. that's good. That and means if you're there, blessed, man. If there was, if there was, maybe I wouldn't even answer because I don't got time for that. I okay, got sorry, bigger this things a busy man. focusing on. <laughs> <laughs> You're focusing on your music. You don't have time for negative negativity. Yeah, so, so that's exactly. good. But I mean, I mean, granted, it it happens as an artist. There's so many things happening nowadays, and and let me tell media. you something. Um, let me tell you something. What most people don't know, as a artist, it don't matter what you say, whether negative or positive about about a artist. That's mm-hmm. also promoting the artist because if you yes, sit you're in, right. you're right. you sit in a group of ten person, and uh, just to say three out of that ten person don't know about this artist. Yeah, but there's something bad that this artist do. Mm-hmm. You know, all these ten people that was in that conversation now become aware of this artist and know this artist, so they go look and search for this artist maybe they go find some of his music and they still go like it not basically his personality but his music they still like so okay you know what i mean it's yeah, a controversial true. stuff you know if they speak negative or positive about the artist that's basically my perspective my opinion you know what i mean okay okay i got you so it's like yeah dealing with something negative that is trending on social media like i mean it, how would you deal with that though as as i say if, if something is trending it all depends if it's if if it's something i know is not true i go declare myself and come to the forefront and okay, say yeah, it's that's not a, true that's true we that's prove, a, that's the right way. but you know what i mean i don't put myself in that position so i don't think there will be something like that trending anything must be trending on social media right now yeah danji get his big break yeah okay. danji if you go collect the grammy uh danji i go on tour some good news you know what I mean? Yeah, man. There yeah. is always good news for Don G. We can't be going in negativity. Yeah, just like this. Now people <laughs> tune in when them see the blast on them phone up on them social media. Yeah. Don G, I got the pan graffiti radio. So right now the world plug up right yes, now. Yes, yes. You hear that, fans? Plug up. Jamaica <laughs> plug up. America plug up. Europe plug up. Everybody plug up right now. No jokes. I'm just one big up. Everyone, each and everyone who are listening to Graffiti Radio right now, DJ Lexi, I speak to Danji. Yes, sir. Out of love for me to you and just go and stay safe in this terrible time. Yeah, and go and true. call upon the most I when you wake up in our morning, give thanks for life. That's give true. thanks for a new day. Living is winning. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hey, you know, when you open your eyes, that's a gift. That's already a gift. You're opening two gifts. So exactly, living is winning, you know. Yes. Okay. So uh, let me stay away from that and go on to another question. Like, what is the weirdest or let's see, funniest thing you've ever been asked in an interview? What's the weirdest thing or funniest thing I've been asked? Like, um. Well, not that I can think of. Now. Can't think of anything. Not that I can think of. Now. Okay. Because when I've been when I've been interviewed, um, the interviewer always asks me the right questions yeah. that they're supposed to ask. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, so yeah. you never had that random question. Oh, I'll, let me be the first then. <laughs> 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 okay, so I have a question. What, like, if you were a fruit? What type of fruit would you be like? What fruit would best describe Donji? What fruit would describe Donji? Maybe I would say mango. A mango? <laughs> I knew you were gonna say mango. You couldn't choose another. You, a mango is, is always in Jamaica. You have to choose something exotic because, you know, Donji is not just a regular mango. Choose something else, man. Uh, avocado. Uh, avocado. <laughs> 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 okay. So, like, okay, right. 
You said you said mango. You said avocado. I know the shape of it. So what exactly is yeah. about the mango and avocado that you say is like donji? <laughs> sweet. You said sweet. <laughs> exactly. Ah, <Aww>, okay. <laughs> So it doesn't have to do with no round the shape, the shapeness of it. No, it's no? it's it's not about it's not about the looks, you know what I mean? It's what's it's within, about uh? the art, what's inside the interior. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I got you. So, um, like, do you have a significant other, somebody that's you know helping you pursue your career, or a wife, a spouse, or anything? Well, definitely. Like Definitely. One Tree Records, Bob Omar, that's my manager. Yeah. So, One Tree Records, Bob Omar is basically the one behind my music. No, I was talking music. about... No, you know that that's not what I was talking about. I'm talking about your wife. Your, 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 uh, your queen. Yes, yes, I do, but I don't want to mention. You don't want to. You don't want to mention. Okay, you know what I mean? yeah. it's on the rap, this guys. This is music, so I. So I, you don't. My personal life, I don't. I don't. I. 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 I never plan to put her there in the. Okay, that's fine. You know I mean? So you... that's personal. Yeah. Okay, ladies. Well, well, you already know. I can't. We can't venture into that. He's already taken, so he's off the market. We have to make sure we say that. You know, cause <laughs> <laughs> you sound you sound like you're getting nervous, Donji. I'm going too far. No, man, that never I That never I Okay. Never get nervous. You say you never get nervous. All right. Well, that's no. true. You're humble. <laughs> you you you're solid. You 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 don't any. There's nothing to rock you. <laughs> so no. there's no. nobody else that you wanna have a specific shout out to. Well, yeah, I career. just want to pick up my mom. You want to pick up my mom back home in Jamaica. She's listening to the interview right now. Okay. Big up my brother also. I'd like to say congratulations to him. You know what I'm congratulating him about. Okay. Yes. No flows. Mm-hmm. Love goes out to my friends, my other family members, and all the well wishers of Dan G. And first and foremost, Big up the Almighty, the Creator, amen, who give me amen. this talent, who give me this breath of life. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right. So awesome. That's awesome, guys. Basically, who I want to shout out right now. And also, my management, One She Records. And also, big shout out to No Rush Records, Junior Brown and the Redemption Project. Mm-hmm. Jan Never Leave. That's a big project right now. So okay. people can stream that one. All right, yeah. awesome, awesome. So, like, as a musician, let me steer clear from them type of questions. So let's go back to the fundamentals. So, as a musician, yeah. um, do you have a favorite, an artist? I'm sorry, do you have a favorite musical instrument that you like? To play You're not wrong. To? You know what I mean? As a musician. Because I'm a musician. That's what in my passport also. If you check, okay. if you know, if you see my passport, if yeah, from I was going to high school, from I graduate and I start being a student, my occupation is musician. So okay. my favorite instruments, mm-hmm. I love the guitar and I also love the keyboard, the piano. Oh, okay, so, you... so those two are my favorite instruments. Okay, so you have a yeah. oh you you know how to play. You're like a um you're proficient in it. You well, I'm not professionally a keyboard player, or a guitar player, but okay. I can help myself. But you just okay, I got you. I understand. Yeah. I got. Get... I get yeah, you. You're yeah. musically inclined. Yeah, because I got even you. this project that I'm coming with soon, the intersection rhythm, mm-hmm. I I play some cards in that in, in instrumental too. So yeah. Oh wow. I'm just showing my versatility. versatility. Oh wow. That okay, project. that's good. That's good. Okay, yeah. so you, I remember back when I was asking you a few questions. You said that. Um, you can mix the lyrics up in your head and everything, and you know, yeah. are you, are you a good freestyle artist? Could you spit something I'm, I'm, for me, real fast, real quick, or 
hopefully I'm not putting you yeah. on the spot. <laughs> yeah, man, my 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 kind of freestyle, man. Can't freestyle. You can't freestyle. You can't hear so I'm piece yeah, or something. Man, but even though with style, I'm not free. I don't know. Nothing. <laughs> yes, yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Is that yeah. no? So we lock in on the scene. Everybody roping. The pandaria the real. chat to the queen. DJ eh, okay. Lexi. Oh, wow. And Angie. Yeah, man. You know what I mean. <laughs> Graffiti red is so nice and clean, yeah. Wow. Everybody lock in and have a nice time. You know, say, it's at the right time. Danji the on the phone line. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah, big up yourself, John Danji. Yo. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> say, yeah. I'll say, I'll give me one dub, man. <laughs> Exclusive. <laughs> oh, my <Anytime>. God. <laughs> that, so, you heard that, yeah, people, man. Danji, freestyle for us. <laughs> Yo, mm-hmm. I um I always I'm always excited when I hear stuff like that. You know, people you know having the lyrics you just, just making up in your head, just right on the spot. It's, yeah, it's, all, it's something I can't do. So, man. you know, yeah, it, 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 born for this, you know what I mean? Yeah, man, We're I can new see. to this. We just stay true to this. <laughs> <laughs> I can see. So, um, Definitely. all right. So, if you had the power, how would you? like make a change um for like in your environment like where you live or if in, if it's in well Jamaica. well okay basically in the environment where i am i've been in this environment like yeah for, five years for um musically and, uh, wise i mean um for like for the music say? like how would you make a change for music in your environment that's in my environment that I am now. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm making the change, you know. I mean, since I've been here, there's a lot of changes because in this country I am, which is um Luxembourg, Central Europe, there's not much reggae scene in this country. And since I've been here, it, it, it's been changed a lot, you know what I mean? There's many functions that I attend. Mm-hmm. They make this function because of me. You know what I mean? And even call it some Jamaican name and stuff like that. So yeah. I think I am making the change, you know. Okay. Right? I, I, Musically I can get in this environment where I am today. Yeah. Okay. I can get that. Um, so it's more like every day you strive to be a better artist. So you, you put that towards making it a better change for the environment. I'm... Exactly. You know what I mean? Being a role model and being an example so okay, ones and ones can even follow my footstep okay you know um, I mean? that's amazing man right. you know it's, it's always hard f- to motivate people or to motivate yourself or being an inspiration for others so for somebody that wants to be into that leadership role it's it's very good when someone takes up that challenge right well you know from you are a artist being a artist you are inspiration you know what i mean that's no true oh you take it i always right? never understood because, when some people right um right they don't artist think... is also close to like the prime minister yes. you know what i mean yes right because the artist of the power of speaking where many people don't have this platform people have the platform to mm-hmm. speak but when you speak as a normal person, who hear you? Your exactly, friends and those exactly. person around you. But when you're a artist, yeah, the world, you're putting your sound out there in the world. So as a artist, you have to know what you put out there in the atmosphere. Because when you put it out there, you can't drag it back. That's true. You that's understand true. what I mean? Exactly. Right. So it, it's just yeah, like that's basically power in the tongue. a role model. Mm-hmm. And being an example that's right. true that's true you, you have to that it's man it's a it's a very heavy weight to carry like being in your shoes sometimes i don't think i would want to be like in the forefront like how it is, you guys, it is it, it is it's not easy 
it's not easy because even being an artist, you're a normal person also. So mm-hmm. you got your ups and you got your downs also. You know yeah, I mean? but nobody wants to see that. They <laughs> want to see you, Danji, being all, you know, reserved, smiling and, you know, showing exactly. a good face to everybody. So it's hard sometimes, I'm sure it is exactly. for an artist exactly. like you. That is true. Right. So, um... All right, so I mean, we're almost to a close. There's seven minutes left in our interview. Do you wanna have? You wanna tell us all your social media handles that everybody can get to book you from, and where to find your music? Are you on Instagram, Facebook, everything? Well, definitely. If you wanna reach out to Danji by any bookings, you can email one three records thirteen at gmail dot com. Or Danji Music, spell with Z I K at gmail dot com, and for my social media, Instagram, it's at Danji Music. That's D O N G M U Z I K. Yeah, and for my Facebook, it's also Danji Music, spell D O N M U S I. K Donji Music All on right. Facebook. And for my YouTube is also Donji Music. D O N M U Z I K Donji Music. You can just Google me. The right out the so right in front of you. Alright? <laughs> <laughs> I can see that. You're being thorough. You make sure yeah. you spell it all in a digital way right now. Yes. Yes, I, I get you. Just like no people find me, people are listening to me right now. Just one click, them just click on graffiti read and yeah, man. And check this, 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 that's right. how we trying to we trying to reach out to everybody. Right. We trying that's to be very global, making sure everybody that don't know Donji, because you know you already have so much experience. Like I said, underneath your right. Belt, so, so for all who didn't know me before, get to know me now. Right yes. here on this platform. I give thanks. You know, it's highly appreciated having this interview with you. Yeah. Okay. I'm so happy to have you. I'm hoping that we can have um, more talks like this again. You know, when you get more um, exposure or whatever, you know, if five years from now, I hope that you come back on here and be like, yo, like, see, I'm glad that I was on your radio and blah blah blah. And I'm so popular. I don't, I don't know how to, well, I'm most be talking. definitely, <laughs> most definitely, without pleasure. Okay, awesome. So, okay, so thanks, guys, for tuning in today with my interview with Don G. Um, it's your girl Lexi, and it was a pleasure being your host today. We're going to close out with some more music from Donji. So, like, stay tuned and keep listening to our radio. Love y'all. Most definitely. Give thanks, DJ Lexi. Graffiti created the whole of America, the whole of Europe, the whole of Jamaica, London, England. Big up, Art of Love, Donji. One tree, I'm out. Awesome. Too much confusion. Then beat up the poor taxi man. Do you use them get wild? Walk one to little island. Too much injustice situation. We need a Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, yeah. One tree, a danji. Two of the things said we not like it. Let me take too much talent on the market. Jan woman and who walk one. Too much confusion. Different page. When me say change, me mean all kind of ways. Like decrease the tax and increase the peers. Tired for work for just minimum wage. Been too long, this tribulation. We have faced it for months and days. You, politician, Mr. Big Man. Why you want poor people cry tears over the years? We need. This corrupt system, 
it need to rearrange. We need a change. We need a change. Our full time now, we turn a different page. To all the things said, we not like it. Them take do my style out of the market. Jan know me no know how I go on. Too much confusion. Them beat up the poor taxi man. We need to take a stand, certain things need to stop As a queen's another get a new trap When you hear from the show, them get killed by cop It's our next innocent life that me could demonstrate We cannot live in a state. The entire place never stay That's why I just attack the truth Get the youths Free life on a different angle Don't get caught in Babylon triangle No easy, not the concrete jungle Say it no simple It needs to rearrange. We need a change. We need a change. Our full time now, we turn a different page. Make we turn a different page. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This system needs to rearrange. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The weekend. Chilling Saturdays. I've been waiting for you. Chilling Saturdays. So long for your touch. Yeah, you girl. Guide me along the way, give me 
those problems Population control, now it's just a trend Things get real sick, really serious You don't even know who to trust The heart of mankind, very evil us Some call up by your name, don't leave me lonely Judge, I never leave my side Don't leave me lonely Please be my shield and my guide Don't leave me Justin, protect me through everything. All when pandemic I go on the COVID 19. Stay alive and survive. Just I do the right thing. Don't leave me. Salvation. I will sing the Lord praise for Jah has been good to me. Don't leave me lonely. Jah Jah never leave my side. Don't leave me lonely. Please be my shield and my guide. Don't leave me lonely. Jah Jah never leave my side. Don't leave me. Justin, protect me through everything. All when pandemic I go 